Hi guys, it's Friggy here th from Techwoods Fall. I'm gonna sh today. I'm gonna show you a basic tutorial how to make a simple and pretty awesome 2D intro. First of all, you're gonna create a Photoshop layer. Um, remember this width and this height. Okay. Inside that, uh, you want your text. Um, I will use. Tech width for all, and you can make whatever you want your Facebook account or anything. I'll just take my YouTube channel. Okay, there we go. I will just make this. Um, I'll just scale this. Just put it. I'll just put it like that. Um, just send that real quick. Just go. What the fuck have I done? Oh, I see. Control E. Oh right. Uh, there is actually print. Oh, this. Oh, I'll just come. Um, this actually look uh, pretty good. Now you have to import um, image, uh, cartoon, anything. I would just recommend you use a cartoon because that looks um, so fucking awesome when you get to it. I will just take Kenny from Sound Park. Boom. I'll just move it a little closer to Kenny. Like that. Make Kenny a little bit bigger. Oh, I'll just redo that. Like that. Now we're gonna save it. Save us. It's called a 2D. Intro. Just save us a PSD file. Yeah, that's all fine. Now you go to After Effects. We're gonna import a file. And import the uh, image you just created. Merge layers. Okay. You're gonna make um, the image you just made to a composition. When you're in that, um, you're gonna click on the um, on the layer. Click P and hold down um, Alt and click right here. See? Now you can type. Now you have to type this simple command. Wiggle bracket three point eight. Okay. Basically, what it does, it's gonna make it rotate, um, shaky. But you see now, it's um, you can see the black right, like right there. That's because the image, uh, we have to scale it a bit. I'll just do it right here. Now we'll see. See, that's look much better. Okay. So um, now we have to add some color correction to it. I'm using Magic Bullet Looks because I think it's um, the best color correction tool you can get. Um, open my Looks Builder. Oh, wow! I'm not my sorry. Uh, I used this pack called There Is Zebra's Color Correction Pack One. I will send a link to it in the description or another color correction pack that's pretty awesome, okay? Now you're gonna find the color correction you just think that's awesome. I actually think this one will work pretty good for the for the intro. Um yeah, right, there we go. Oh no, I will actually did it a bit. That's way too much I think. What the fuck is this supposed to be? You can't even see shit. Yeah. It's, it's a bit shiny, but um, that's okay. Let's just keep with that. Now I'm gonna import some particles. I will put a link for that in the description too. I'm um, gonna import it and just drag it in. Now it's all black. You just have to go to uh, the mode here and just change it to overlay. 
And now uh, I'll just need to composition to about the 10 seconds mark. And now see. I don't really know if you notice, but there is a lot of particles circling around, and that's going to be a pretty awesome effect. Um, I'll just uh, do something you can see here. You can see in the sides right here, you see there? Pretty badass effects. It's so fucking. S oh, sorry. It's so simple and still so badass. Um, yeah. I'm gonna log I can just show you how to render it. Add to render queue. You go onto here. Choose the place. And yeah, just save it right there. I just have to make sure these things are important, right? Resign. Yeah, exactly. Okay, then you just uh, push the render button. I'll come back when it's rendered. Okay, so mine is fully rendered and got it right here. I just have. I can just show you it. See, pretty badass with the pipe particles and all things. Um, that was actually it for this tutorial. Hope you liked. Remember to subscribe. Peace out. Te veo hasta acá y bien sofocado Escribiendo cositas desesperadas Invento una cosa nueva, la 